economic stimulus, as you all know, provided us with a fantastic uh, vehicle. Um, the fact that um, over and beyond the amount of money, when you combine the economic stimulus monies with our regular uh, fiscal year 10 monies, with our disaster monies, you can add up a program to almost $3 billion, which is about three times the amount of what our normal amount would be. And so we have so much more to work with. And by the way, too, because stimulus provided us some, ac uh, some actual funds regarding administrative, um, within the agency, we were able to encourage and support additional staff in the states. Uh, and, and, and that's how we have applied this, has been to actually designate and work with our state directors in each state. And you, and you all know that that's how we deliver the program is in the state. And to have an extra hand is, is critical. And I say that because if you followed the federal government and certainly USDA rule development, you've seen that, uh, that was, that's, that actually had not been the case. We had been cut back in, in previous years. So uh, bringing all of that together has been a great energizer for us. And so we've taken this uh, very, very strongly and have proceeded with, number one, continuing to make loans. And you all know that that's how we left off our meeting in Dallas. And we'll say this uh, again and again. Um, let us continue to make loans. I'm pleased to announce that in regards to economic stimulus fund usage of about $1.6 billion, we are 48% in fund usage at this point, 48%, and, um, which is very critical. Our goal for April the 16th is 70% fund usage, and, and you know our ultimate goal is 100% fund usage so that we can um, fully utilize all of the funds that were, were uh, allocated to us but I think also to make a, a very, very powerful statement that in this day and age when we have um, the downturn in the overall economy, that rural America is still very active and that we have some great uh, opportunities for be it business development, job creation, or something which is also very critical, and I've said this time again, time and again, which is uh, job savings and business retention. So all of those elements are very much in play right now as we have um, um, uh, proceeded with the program. And uh, I know Pandor, when he has an opportunity to speak, will talk more specifically about the kinds of projects that, that have come our way. And the beauty of our rural business program is that we are very flexible in the type of businesses that can be um, uh, supported. And, um, and everyone knows it's not just agriculture-related activity. It can be the, the, the same type of quality of life uh, needs that we would see in urban America. We, we want to see the same in rural, and that's why we fall under rural development within uh, the United States Department of Agriculture.